Hi there, I'm Vicki Parfano. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to do a craft haul on Simple Stories, the range Emoji Love. And I plan on doing a whole set of projects using some of these products, in particular the Docket Journal, which is Emoji Love. And this is going to fit into my Traveller's Notebook. And I wanted to do a project called Be Happy, which is kind of one of the themes I've got going here. And I wanted to do it for myself, really, because I enjoy having a gratitude journal on the go. And I thought this one, excuse all that noise, this one would make a perfect gratitude journal. But so here I have the Simple Stories Emoji Love Stickers. There are eight four by six sheets. So let's get into this. You can see on the back what's there. And I thought I'd buy everything I could from the range that was available to get going on this project with you guys. And if you'd like to join in, I would love to see what you make in your journal as well. So I have, here are the sheets. Has lots of these small words, which I absolutely adore. Yay, hi, oh my God, LOL. We've got some alphabet stickers, more labels. I love these little speech bubbles. These are good. And some more. Now, these are all stickers, so they're going to be really easy to use inside this docket journal. And I chose everything because of its size. I absolutely love these decorative brads. I don't have very many brads in my collection, but they all go beautifully with the colorways. And I thought, well, instead of me trying to find things to go with this, I'd just do a project that used one line of papers. So it has got a funny little emoji on the back there. But these are all great too. So I can see them going inside my journal perfectly. Now we have the sticker sheets. There are 803 stickers in total. So for the Be Happy project and this journal here that I'm using for it, it's just going to be a daily reference to gratitude, what makes me happy. It's going to be a project that goes for one month. So it'll be a month of happy things. So 30 days of happiness. So for me, I think that's a great way to focus what I'm doing and think about the good stuff, think all the, about all the things I am grateful for and have something that I can look back on that goes for a whole month. Now you can start this at the beginning of the month, at the middle of the month, it doesn't really matter. It's just 30 days of happy. So let's have a look inside here and see what's inside. So again, lots of little prompts, some fun things about what you're doing through the day. More of these words, which I absolutely love. Not my circus, not my monkeys. Ha, that's a funny one. Yep, pretty much. Another one. It is what it is. A roll on the floor laugh. Today or not today, no selfie control. Shut the front door. So it's a lot of fun. It's something that encourages me to look on the bright side and go, you know what? Had a good time today, did all these sort of fun things. So that's the next one and the emoji love snack pack i'm actually going to use in my docket journal so and this is going to be something that provides me with my focus for the page now it has some die cuts in here and i picked up the die cuts that went with this and i thought well i really don't need both because i've got some in the snack pack and they look pretty similar i think the other ones might have been fractionally fractionally i can't say that word hang on fractionally larger and sorry about all the sound of the um, plastic here. But these are a better size. And you can see how easy it is to get some love happening on the page with this size of die cuts. And it's just fun. It's just a really fun project. Look at this. Unicorn. One of my favourite sayings. When somebody told me I lived in fantasy land, I almost fell off my unicorn. <laughs> Taco. Oh crap, that one is. Yeah, some thumbs up, or you could put thumbs down, you know, if you didn't like something, you could put it there. But it is going to be a focus on being happy. And I just think emojis are what are going to do it for me, and hopefully for you guys too. So you can see in these cards, there's a whole stack of them. There they are. So there are 112, so there are 18 4 by 6 cards, 36 3 by 4 cards. 12 4x4 four four cards and 24 of two of the double-sided cards and 22 bits and pieces. So we just looked at the bits and pieces. Let's get into the cards. 
I love the two by two size. I really, really like this size. So I like using these in photo albums as well. I like the two by twos. I know a lot of people don't like them, but I made a lot of twinchies over the years when twinchies and inchies were very popular in card making. I did a lot of twinchy pieces or inchy pieces to go on cards. And, you know, I just, I've just got into enjoying this size. I really do like it. It's going to look brilliant inside my docket journal. And two sides to every story. So you get the words or no words on the front. It says no words. Um, and then you get the designer paper on the back. So you can flip them. There's my favourite unicorn again. BFF, heart eyes. So you can flip them over depending on which side of it you want to use. And this is just going to be a really fun project. Just goes for 30 days. So I think it's easy to do something for 30 days rather than daily all year long. You know, most of us can commit to doing something for a month, to commit for a year. I do like that one. That's got a lot of little ones on it. To commit for a year, there's an Instagram, love it is a little bit harder. So I thought a 30 day project is a great one. We can do it together. And I can talk to you about the frustrations of trying to get uh, a double page done each day. <laughs> but we'll go through it together. And this size is not as intimidating as trying to do a big 12 by 12 album. I mean, you can't get much smaller than this for, for scrapbooking. And you know, it's good. Next cards, these are really nice. I mean, they're all nice. Very bright colours, and that's what I was looking for. So let's get into this one. Okay, yay. Like. So these are similar to those. I think they're almost exactly the same. They're just a bigger size. Oh, I didn't see the 100. Emoji love. OMG, ha ha. <laughs> Oh crap, I think that's a cute one. There's a big unicorn. I care and a donut. Friday, but first pizza. <laughs> like that. And then this is really nice too. Okay, I speak fluent emoji. Well, actually, I don't know. Are you really fluent in emoji? You know, when I put emojis in my texts, I think, oh, I'm pretty sure that's what that one means. I'm not 100% sure that. There must be an emoji dictionary somewhere. If somebody hasn't invented it, I think they need to. So this is some journaling spaces. That's cute. So I do use a lot of emojis on my texts and in Instagram, I have to say. Uh, are you an emoji lo lover too? Are you, do you use them or do you overuse them like I probably do? Uh, yeah, just leave it in the comments below. Let me know. All the heart eyes here. Yeah, I did like that one. Ha ha ha. So this is going to be a really lighthearted project. It's not going to be too serious. It's going to be fun. It's going to be short and sweet. It's going to be a month long. And each of the double page spreads we're going to get done really, really quickly. Because that's what it's about. And then get out there and have some fun. Get out of the craft room and live. Okay. Love ya, love you more. See, this is typical of one of my texts to my friend Michelle in particular because we have this little love ya going on all the time. It's kind of cool. I can't even. How good is that? And then there's a sad one. He might be allowed in the Be Happy Project. What do you reckon? Yeah, we might put him in briefly and then we'll cheer him up. What do you say? Yes. <laughs> okay. And again, similar, that's a different one. There's a few different ones. There's a not sure about that. Yeah, so if there is an emoji dictionary out there, I would love to know where it is and where I could find it. So if you know how to speak fluent emoji, and I mean really fluent emoji, let me know how you learned that because I would like to know how to speak absolutely fluent emoji too. So here's some more of the cards coming up now. Let's, oh, that one's stuck. Okay. So, very cool. I do love the Simple Stories lines because everything's coordinated for you. You don't have to put too much thinking power into it. See, there they are on the back there. I'll just leave that there while I open these. And yeah, it's all coordinated. There were a couple of more things in the range that I didn't buy. As I said, I didn't buy the large packet of these because it came in with a snap pack. Um, there were some, I think they were little post-it notes I didn't buy either I'm not a post-it fan really 
Um, so I, I didn't think I'd use it in the project. Seriously awesome. Oh, how cool is that font? That's a really fun font, isn't it? You know, I love modern calligraphy, but this is just, mm, I like it. I like that a lot. Lots of room for journaling and love. And oh, crap. <laughs> okay, and more of them here. Another journaling box. There's no emoji for how I feel about you. Ooh, that's funny. Oh, my God. Lots of emojis there. It's really bright. It's really over the top bright. It's really over the top cheerful. That didn't just happen. It's over the top fun. And I think sometimes we need a project like this to just lighten up <laughs> and know that it's not the end of the world if something doesn't end the way we thought it might or turn out the way we thought it might. There's always tomorrow and we're going to do 30 days of happy. Oh, happy day. Meh, maybe not. <laughs> Oh, no, we're going to put happy day. There we go. That's going to be on top. Okay, so that's my whole video. So if you didn't have a docket journal, you could just use a traveler's notebook for this or any kind of small notebook so that it's not too big, not too intimidating. Like we can get two pages done easily, right? Yeah, I'm sure we can. Okay, I hope you enjoyed that haul today and I'm looking forward to getting this project up and running for you. So stay tuned. It'll be happening very, very soon. 30 days of happy. <laughs> Bye for now.